Attorney General Ashley Moody was in Tampa today to present an award to a Hillsborough County Sheriff's Corporal. Corporal Mike Blair adopted his son Ronnie after a horrific night of murder and a long road to recovery for the little boy. We brought you their stories last year. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson joins us now live in Ybor City with this update. Jeff. Good evening, Jenna Keith. This story begins with the murder, but it involves so much more. A Hillsborough County Sheriff's Corporal and his wife who opened their home and their hearts to a young man who really needed them. It began in March of 2018 when Ronnie O'Neill III murdered his girlfriend Kenyatta Barron and their daughter Ronivia. On that horrific night, Hillsborough County Sheriff's Deputy Mike Blair met little Ronnie, who had been set on fire by his father. As he recovered from his injuries, Mike Blair and his wife Danielle began to know Ronnie and eventually adopted him. They let me into their home to tell their story after Ronnie O'Neill was sentenced to life in prison. Today, Attorney General Ashley Moody recognized Blair and his family, and she spoke directly to young Ronnie. I think God put Danielle and Corporal Mike in your life, and you, more importantly, in theirs. Uh, you have been a blessing to them, and I know it was an honor, as they have told me, that uh, they stood by your side after that hard night and helped you heal. The Blairs will also receive a one-time stipend of $25,000 for adopting Ronnie as part of a new state law encouraging other law enforcement officers to adopt as the Blairs have. Corporal Blair chose to remember Ronnie's mother and sister. I would be remiss if I did not mention um, Kenyatta and Renivia. That's Ronnie's mom. And this big deputy had to pause for a moment to finish his thought. Ronnie and Renivia were best friends. They love to play together. And I know that Ronnie took a lot of care of her. Corporal Blair hopes other law enforcement families will do what he has done. We hope to encourage others. We hope that this story does encourage others to get involved in fostering and domestic adoption. We got a lot of kids out there. And there is a new state law to help. It gives law enforcement families a one-time $10,000 stipend if they adopt. It's a $25,000 stipend if they adopt a child with special needs. Attorney General Moody says she hopes that others will follow in the Blair's footsteps. Live in Ybor City, Jeff Patterson, 8 on your side.